Well, now that we fixed that stupid leak, I guess I can take a break. No more paperwork for me. Besides, life's been pretty good so far. You know, this whole theme park business might be the new future. Hmm. Might be, anyway. <laughs> At least I don't have to deal with Chica or Foxy for the rest of the week. <sighs> Stan, I asked for a Frappuccino. This is a... Hot coffee. <laughs> and I asked for white chocolate. Uh, oh, John. Yeah, small world. Didn't get I you your right coffee? Small, but... Uh, no, I got a hot coffee, which is not what I asked for. Wait. No, this is yours, buddy. Here, switch. I drink my coffee hot and black. Okay, then you can take yours. Mm -hmm. You're not sick or anything. Oh, no. <laughs> if I was sick, you think I'd show up? I know the whole virus thing going around, but, you know, we're fine. Uh, six feet, six feet. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, but no, I've just been doing paperwork, uh, the usual. Business is up, though. Well, the delivery side of things. Right. <laughs> Thankfully, that is, uh, unlike Freddy Land, still not open. Hey, don't let it beat you up too much. We're making plenty of money off of merch sales alone. Actually, uh, I mean, 15% you know, boost. <laughs> 15? Mm -hmm. I, I, uh, that bad. I got some ads going around uh, doing this anniversary sale. Uh, but, you know, it's, uh, it's going well. I got animatronics doing deliveries now. So, making you have animatronics money. doing deliveries? What? Yep, I always had my animatronics do deliveries. They're perfect for it, actually. Uh, they get tips. Uh, they don't take the tips. Uh, we get that money full heartedly back. And we get to mark it as non-taxable income, since it's technically a a tip. Hmm. I should get my animatronics to get something to do something like that. Well, they should be. I did send out a memo for them to start. Did they, have they not been doing that? Hmm. Uh. No. Put it on the list. I'll put it on the list. Anyway, uh, <laughs> let's get some air, right? Yeah. Uh, later, Stan. And next time, get the coffee right. Oh, it's probably just got it mixed up. I do come here, like, every day. Ugh. I, mean, I would hope so. <laughs> it is my job. How's, uh, <sighs> theme park been? Been having fun? I mean, it's been going good. I'm building a new line of animatronics. Oh, really? Hope that's mm -hmm. going well. Yeah. <laughs> the glam rock animatronics. Glam the future rocks. of Freddy Fazbear's entertainment. What, are you going to do some sort of 90s thing? That's what I hear when I hear glam rock. <laughs> I mean, sort of. You know, what you know what they say, what is old can be new again. Well, they'll come back trending for sure. Nostalgia always hits them where they want it. Exactly. Are they going to be here? Or are you doing that somewhere else? Uh, it's sort of like a surprise. Yeah, of course. <clears throat> Keep, keep it to yourself. You don't have to tell me anything. Um, obviously, if it's coming out of your expenses, <laughs> not the restaurants. Right. My expenses. It is. I mean, I did just sell my house. Oh, I oh, heard about that. My house. Where'd what do you mean you to? heard about that? You were there when I was moving. Well, I didn't get to see where you got to move from. I didn't know if you got a downgrade or not. A down? No, I had to move back here because of security reasons. Oh, that's right. Still having problems with, uh, what's his name? Shadow something? Uh, it's been quiet for a while, so things are kind of looking up. That's good. I don't get around that part much. But work's been well. <laughs> so, good. uh, Glamrock animatronics. Seems like you've been yeah. busy. Seen some animatronic you found out of the sewer. I, I heard you were in the sewer for some reason from Twisted Chica. Uh, I found Funtime Foxy. Yeah, I uh, heard you found them. I seen them laying on the table when I uh, fixed uh, Twisted Chica a few weeks ago. All right, wait, what? Yeah, I, I fixed Twisted Chica a little while back, maybe. Wait, how did you fix Twisted Chica? Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> I've been learning how to repair animatronics ever since I've been in this business. I understand that, but their coding is completely different from this the world that they're from. Oh, how well. were you able to figure that out? It was just a little bit of hearsay, she say. I mean, we already have Chica models here. It's not like I fixed them to their core. I just gave them what we have. 
It's not like I can make their original suits or anything. So I just had the computer analyze it. And when it does the 3D printing, uh, we have this coding dex that will go around and complete the suit from what's missing. And obviously parts and voice boxes, well, I just cleaned them out. I mean, she wasn't even that broken. Endoskeleton was though, and she's leaning to the left a little bit. I need to get a new gyro system for her, but uh, that's besides the point. She's uh, basically like brand new as far as we can tell. Uh, if you see her around, she won't even sound the same. So treat her with respect and just say that the rest of them can be fixed they want. That's what I've been telling them. They don't have to take over our world to be happier at least. I just never thought that they could be fixed so easily. Oh, trust me. It was kind of hard to... Honestly, it was just the timing. I mean, I've been trying to figure out how, to, how I was going to do it for a while. Because the suit was kind of stuck to them. And it was either I have to burn the suits off or then fix them and it was like I can't take their CPU drives out and put them in someone else so I had to fix what we already had some of them are a bit unfixable than the others but if you find them and they're still angry eh, tell them we can fix them I mean Twisted Cheek is a great example of that I know Twisted Bonnie would probably like that well uh, send them my way yeah for sure But uh, anything new with you? I uh talked to Davis a little bit oh how would that go well, as good as it's always been critical guy uh thinks i need to stop but i'm not gonna stop what i'm good at besides i told you i was gonna help you and i'm gonna finish that right <sighs> besides that uh, michael's doing well opened up a new restaurant last summer actually has another one opening soon that's his i think 12th restaurant 12th restaurant wow starting a big chain Really took up his dad's footsteps. I've been trying to get him to come around, but the guy's so busy. I miss him, though. Mm -hmm. I miss it back when it was simple. Remember when I first showed up here and you showed me your restaurant, Brian? <laughs> mm -hmm. Fun times. I know. You even gave me a bit of starting money to do my own. Well, look at you now. I guess. Never forget where you come from, though. Look at me. Still struggling. Hey, it's always but a struggle. But I'll make through it. You didn't let me finish. Oh, okay. I'll make through it. And get through it. <laughs> I do miss the pizzeria days, though. Which is why I have a surprise. You do? I know everybody will probably like. <laughs> you gonna keep it a surprise, then? It's gonna be a surprise. Okay. You're not doing too bad, then. <sighs> well... Hopefully not. Going by the day, you know, hmm. just taking it out as, as it is. Well, I'm always here for you, Brian. Huh. <sighs> Hopefully there hasn't any been any inspections lately. I've been so exhausted from those. Oh, don't worry. I got a new guy working for me. His name's Roy. Ugh. <sighs> Oh, so that's who... Let me guess. Is that the guy that's in front of your new place? Mm-hmm. A.K.A. that looks like a casino from Las Vegas? <laughs> hey, gotta... Kids like slot machines, too, Brian. Gotta get those quarters in the machine somehow. But Roy was actually yeah. trying to get something out of me. So I figured I'd hire him. <laughs> Keep him on our side. Get something out of... Wait a minute. This isn't the same person that was trying to extort you for information. Well, more like he was going to sell it to the press and kind of ruin the whole oh, thing we're doing. Oh, my God. Are you out of your mind? Hey, keep your enemies close, Brian. Besides, paid him really well. And he's been doing a few background checks on the security I want to hire around here. And the way things go, it's better to have someone on your side who can get information. He's a journalist. I mean, the least I can do is give him a job doing what he likes. Right, but isn't that just a little bit suspicious? I mean, who's going to... not at least a bit worried? Oh, about him? Oh, no. Yeah. Not at all. If he was going to do something, he'd already done it. Besides, I think Moulton's been keeping an eye on him. Besides that, I don't think he wants his friend in any predicament. I think, Brian, that I have given him everything he's wanted. His journalistic integrity is still intact. 
And all he had was some old and new stories that he was just going to republish to drive down sales mm -hmm. here. And it doesn't sound like that'd be too good for the both of us. It's just business, Brian. Just business. I mean, I guess, but... <sighs> well, it's always nice to... Well, I threw that off the edge. Oh, wait a litter. I'll pick it up on my way down. Did you pick yours up? Yeah, it's right here. Yeah, I am not a good catch. <laughs> oh. oh, God. Uh, there's so many meetings coming up, I'm not even excited for them. Oh, meetings are always dreadfully boring, Brian. Super boring. <laughs> Trust me. When I was CEO, that's all I did. Going around restaurants, collecting money, trying to improve sales. You can literally uh, suck you dry. Oh, at least of time. <sighs> well, you have fun, Brian. Oh, wait. What? Isn't there like a board meeting coming up soon? Uh, There's an end of the year meeting that should be happening soon about sales and... Um... Yeah, 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 I forgot. I just got that in my email like the other day. Well, yeah, it's a pretty important meeting. Um, yeah, and you need to go. I just remember I got it. I had to tell you oh, that you, you had to tell me I needed to go Why do I have to go oh, again six feet apart? Why do I need to go? Um, well, I mean you are you know around here now and you have been contributing a lot of work here, so I believe it is Obligatory for you to go You're one of the biggest chains we have of course they emailed you to show up they probably want to know right. how you're keeping sales up in these times and want to distribute that to other businesses. Don't you think you should go? Oh, I'll be there, but you definitely need to be there as well. If they wanted the CEO there, they would have emailed me. Well, I think you should probably go to that. If I go and you don't show up, you know I'm going to be kind of tid mad at you. You're just trying to get out of work. What? No! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I mean, Davis is going to be there, too, so, I mean, there you have it. <sighs> of course. Of course he'd be there. <sighs> Let me pick up my trash. Listen, Brian, I am more than happy to go do that. It's just... <sighs> oh, God. They're going to get up all in my case. You know they don't like it when I'm at one place for too long, and I haven't been trying to make money at other locations. I've been trying to keep this one alive. I think they really care about that right now. I think you'd be surprised how selfish they can be. I mean, this... Oh, trust me, I know. When they came here to go inspect everything. Oh, yeah. When, when uh, Michael was trying to open up one of his restaurants, he had to get me to come in to convince them to give him the loan for it. They wouldn't just give him the money, and even though Michael had it, it was about the principle of keeping it in the business. Honestly, Brian, I'll go, but it's not going to be good for either of us. They're going to get on my case for staying here so long, and they're going to get on You think yours. I want to go? I don't. Of course I don't. Uh, the, meetings... the last thing I want to do. I, 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 okay, okay. Um, I'll, I'll do it then. Uh, call it a favor, okay? I'll go. A favor? I mean, yes. I guess. I mean, just know, like, if we all throw our faces, I think we would have a better chance than if they won. A.K.A. me went alone. You probably wouldn't know how to explain how our sales have been so up anyway. Fine. Well, no, I've been dealing with, you know, killing animatronics from other worlds. So, no, I don't <sighs> think so. Not a word of that. They, of course, right? You, you haven't been telling them those things, right? Now, in what mind do you think I would tell them that? Are I'm you, just asking. They don't know that there's a portal in here, so no, they do not know any of that. <sighs> well, they're not stupid. They'll know you've been distracted by something, and they'll ask while I'm here. What's our excuse going to be? Uh, and. I could just tell him about my Glamrock and animatronics. No, 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 no. With that as a cover. No, 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 no. No? Um, while, while I do think that's great, Brian, um, come here, come here, come here. What? It's audio everywhere. Okay, uh, don't tell him about anything you're doing. Listen, if the company gets a sniff of what you're going to do, they'll try to take it, they'll market it for themselves, and they'll spread it everywhere. You want it to be unique? Do it your own way. Michael's been making new animatronics himself, and he hasn't been selling them to the sort of FNAF Afton brand. He's been keeping them homebrew. 
I think if you got this idea, Brian, you run with it. Don't give it to the corporate. You show it to corporate, they're going to ruin it. That's all I'm, I'm going to say about it. But better excuse, uh, tell them I came here because I seen the profits were down. I know I wasn't a charge of being CEO at the time, but you decided that you'd give me that control and the business has been up a little bit. I'll tell them that the time I've spent here is for the benefit of the company in a whole because it's the most profitable branch we have. Right. So it'll be fine. Anything else you want to talk about? Not that I can think of. Okay. Well, uh, throw this in the trash for me, will you? Do I look like a maid to you? You look like my friend who will throw something in the trash for me. But you ain't too rich to go go to the recycling bin, are you? I guess I'll do that for you. Thank you, Brian. See you in the meeting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you in the meeting. Oh, God. Well, this has been an experience. I do have to come up with a better excuse. They're going to get pissy that I haven't been trying to bleed people dry. Well, the quarterly success, at least when everything is said and done, they're not going to really be able to take me away from the place. They're just going to want me to do more. Mm. Do what I can, do what I can. Where is my car? I'm going to kill Foxy. I'm going to wring him up by his neck. And then I'll force feed cheese down his throat. <laughs>